True, but I just think Jones' ground game is just... Yeah, he's wrestling you know, too, right? He's his just, wrestling, his jiu-jitsu. I, I think out of sight, his striking is a lot better, but um, I think Jones is just bigger, thicker, and yeah, his wrestling is a better difference, you know? And his experience. Yeah, but like I said, experience, but when you're getting older, that experience tends to, you know, he slows down a little bit, right? He's not as hungry and everything. Yeah, he's not as, he, he already accomplished a lot. I, Jonathan's one of my favorite fighters, but I can't, you know, I can't really say nothing about him, but. Uh, he, he's, he hasn't been looking the same, bro. Especially with that, that one dude that tore his ACL. Oh, uh, Santos. He, he yeah, looks Santos. horrible. Yeah. I thought Reyes won that fight too, bro. The last fight? Uh, I didn't watch it, but I knew that um, he won the... They said he won the third, fourth, and fifth round, right? Um, yeah, that's what... Yeah. yeah. Jones? I, I thought, yeah, I thought Reyes won the first three. They said, they said the first two went to him, the third round was questionable, and then the fourth and fifth, Jones, like... like Took over, yeah. Took over. Yeah. But I, yeah, like I said, I think I'll watch the fight all over again because Reyes won, he got robbed. But like I said, what, in that situation like that, when you're the champion, you, when you're the challenger, you have to like absolutely destroy that champion. Yeah, the size of her, yeah. I kind of, I, I mean, with a guy like Jones, because he's undefeated, he holds all like, he, he fucking, he's written in the history books, you know, with all the records. Yeah. But I kind of, I, you know, it's hard. You gotta really beat him. Yeah, you know, if it's close like that, you can't. You can't keep it close to the fight. You can't keep it close to the judges. You know how the judges are gonna react. Yeah. Did you see the Latifi uh, Lewis fight? I was just about to say that, bro. They were in uh, uh, Lewis's hometown. Well, I I didn't watch the fight either. I didn't watch that card. But like I heard people saying, like, if you're if you're gonna be explosive like that, so Latifi's explosive for the first couple rounds, like the first mm -hmm. first two rounds. And he completely gasses out. Yeah. With him, you and Lewis had shit wrestling. But the main thing with him is he was taken down and he wasn't doing no damage. That's the problem, yeah. And then whenever they were on the feet, uh, Lewis would just go crazy. Yeah, so that, that's that's the situation right there. You can't, like, take him down and just stay there. That does nothing. Yeah, well, exactly. is, my thing is, it depends on what the judging looking at. What's the judging looking at, you know what I mean? So if right. the judges... They like dominance, so like if they like the pressure, the pressure, pressure, then okay. You good over here? Right. Then yeah. they like that. But other than that, it's, most of the time, judges want to see action. They want to see punching. They want to see that. Right. They want to see blows. I mean, you, but that's the thing too. Like, we got to know what the judges want to see because that shit's a problem, you know? If they score takedowns over, over a knockdown, you know what I mean? Like, I'm who the yeah. fuck knows? So, but I don't know. It's weird. It's Dana, even Dana yeah. with like his contender series, you know how he has a show? Yeah. So there's one guy, his name is Brandon Laho or something like that, and he's like a, he's a well-known 145 fighter, and I think he was on the Ultimate Fighter and everything, so he was on contender series, and he was fucking the guy up, the other guy, and the last 10 seconds, he shot for a takedown.